Arsenal fan TV, down here at the Emirates. Um, listen, I've got Dave here, big gooner. He was just walking past. I wanted to uh, stop him and ask him, what are you made of the signing of actually two great signings today? Number one, Pierre-Emerick Aubameyang, world-class player, right? And number two, Ozil signing on. Um, he signed on for another three and a half years. What have you made of that today? Well, as a Wednesday, it's probably one of the best Wednesdays I've had in the world, to be fair, mm. is it? I can't argue. Aubameyang, top class, Rob, to be honest with you, mate. He is mm. top class. And that is an amazing sign, isn't it? Literally. And, mm. you know, there's a lot of Liverpool fans out there, I reckon. Oh, down the road. Probably even Chelsea, because if, if they mm. manage to pull Giroud, we've had a better deal out of that. I don't think anyone says, I like Giroud, don't be yeah. wrong, but we've definitely had the better sort If he goes there, we yeah. get about 100% here. And the reversal signing, which is a big boost. Yeah, it's been a great Wednesday, but the problem is... I was just about to say, I sense a butt. Yeah, but the problem is, is that it, I like it, but we had a bad Tuesday. Look at last night, and that's yeah. that's what it is. It's just like, you know, I'm not going to judge again in a day because it was a goalkeeper mistake last night that put us in a bad. Like, but but it's, we've seen it all before, Rob. That's the mm. problem, mate. We've seen it all before, and it's like I, I can't see it changing. The problem is, it, it like I just it's like we've bought a Ferrari, but we've got Stevie Wonder driving it, mate. Yeah. <laughs> That is literally what it is. We've got no clue because at the back, Rob, I'm telling you, mate, I have no idea what is going on. You look at last night yeah. and it's just like... There is still talk that we could get a defender in by the end of the day, but definitely well, last night... Tony Adams got his boots laced up, is he it? Is he it? His big tone got his boots laced up because I'll tell you what, mate, it's either that or Barese or Maldini, one of the two. Mate... Yeah, we need them. Oh, but it is... On the, po on the positive it's though, it's because normally transfer windows, yeah. when was the last time we've had a transfer window like this? Where, we you know, I mean, you look at it at the start of the transfer window, we were looking at Alexis Sanchez, you know, going. Um, I was thinking to myself, we won't replace him Not with yet. light for light. Alexis has gone out, you could say we've replaced it with Mikaterian and Abamyang. And I was looking at it today, and they said that their two wages combined wouldn't be the amount of money they would have had to have paid Alexis. So Arsenal done a great deal, well, haven't they? You know what? I think going forward, we're better. Mm. Honestly, mate, and I don't care about Sanchez, honestly, no more. I, honestly, fuck him, mate. He's a dick. I couldn't mm. give a shit. He's done, like Lee, he's done exactly what fucking Van Persie's done it mm. years ago. He's gone for the Wonga, mate. And he might he might win it. It's a couple of trophies. Bear yeah. more, but he's gone for the Wonga, mate. We offered him yeah. a big wedge. Yeah, look at Ozil today, it. Well, he's on it. We've offered Sanchez a big wedge. He's gone for the Wonga, mate, yeah. Mm. So fuck him. Fuck United, what? What? fuck Manchester, and I tell you what, uh, your mates, uh, uh, what's his name, McCola, yeah. and that fat fucking Cherry Bakewell monster, uh, Halson, yeah, <laughs> fuck him as well, fuck all the Manchester that lot, because at the end of the day, I don't care about it. They were my friends, they're not going to be my friends no, no more. I don't give a fuck here, fuck them, mate, fuck them, honestly, I don't care about Sancho, I think we're stronger, yeah. I honestly think offensively we're stronger, it. Yeah. The problem is, looking back last night, it wasn't a problem, oh, alright, we didn't play great last night, even offensively, it. Mm. But I think the problem was that like, it's defensively. And that's been the same role for years, mate. It's been the same mm. for years. Fucking you know, hell, I remember going back to fucking 2000, what, 9, 10 season. We went to Wigan. Well, actually, no, we had Tottenham and Wigan away mm. in a week. And we still in the chart of league. We lost to Tottenham 2-1 at White Lane. Went to Wigan, we were 2-0 up mm. and got beat 3-0 in the Zogbia school in the last minute. And then fucking three years later, we went to Anfield. I remember seeing you at Anfield mm. three years later. 13, 14 season, we was falling down off for 20 minutes, yeah. And then we collapsed and come as fourth, we was top of the league that day. Away from home, mate, I'm sorry. Stop I'm spoiling my positivity, I, I, no, man. No, 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 no. <laughs> I'm just being, no, I, I know what you mean. I, yeah. I'm just being a realist. I don't want to get too carried away. Yeah, it's yeah. a great end of the day to, uh, window, honestly, mate. But I don't think it's the be all and end all, do you know what I mean? Yeah, if yeah. we defend like we did yesterday in the Europa League, honestly, not against us, the fucking Osterridge, whatever they are, or whatever we come in. <laughs> I'm not saying that, I don't know what, if we lose to them, like, that's, that's Wenger gone P45, mate, yeah. But if we defend like that against a Napoli, or a Letico Madrid, mate, mm. adios, gone, mate, yeah. yeah. So that's gone, and the first thing we're taking out, and that, and that, that is the worry, yeah. What were we, nine points behind? What was it? Eight top points, four? I think, off the top four now. Oh, mate, it's gone. I'm saying now, Rob, it's so gone. Maybe Europa League's up, and unfortunately, yeah, Aubameyang nine, can't play in, in the Europa, Europa League, League yeah. but um, Mkhitaryan can. Yeah, but if we go and sell Giroud tonight, yeah. who have we got up to? If Lacka gets injured, who are we going to play up top? Yeah. Danny Welbeck? Well, that's if he's not off the off the old injury list. Yeah. I love Danny a bit, but he, he's not. you couldn't rely on him. Yeah. Let, me, let me just ask you finally, finally, yeah, um, the Giroud thing. What have you made of that? I mean, that's come out of the blue as well. I mean, you know, Giroud going to uh, Chelsea of all clubs. I mean, do you do you think to yourself, well, good luck to him. Um, he wants to play in the World Cup. Or do you look on it and say we should never be selling him to Chelsea? As a person, good luck to him. 
yeah. because I think he deserves it and he's always done all right for us. He's helped. How many times has he come off the bench and he's mm. nicked a goal as an equaliser or a winner? It yeah. normally for a header, mm. but. For me, like you just said, rope the league. I don't think we should be selling him, right? Because your mm. bangman can't play it. So if Lacazette picks up an injury, who, who are we going to play up front? We've got no one up front. Mm. We've sold Walcott. Sanchez is gone. So you know, for me, I just I, I don't think we should be selling him. But you know, with our board, mate. Honestly, I, I'll be amazed by eleven o'clock if we don't flog him, mate. I'm telling you, now, I'll be amazed, absolutely amazed. But I one thing I want to say before we go. Is that you know Piers Morgan? It yeah. he had that thing with Trump the other day, didn't he? It yeah. with that shirt, that lot, yeah. Do you know what? And it sounds bad, but I was thinking, you know, Trump was on about that wall, wasn't he? Yeah. He was building that wall between Mexico, wasn't he, and mm. America, wasn't it? Yeah. We need yeah. that wall in front of fucking our back four, mate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> why can't we get Trump to sort of send a finger? Oh, why can't we get him to come over? Get Donald in. Piers, are you listening? Piers, if you listening, mate, do us a favour. Get Donald, yeah. Build that fucking twelve foot wall. Front of our 18 yard box, and we'll, we'll probably go and win the league, mate. Yeah, so I reckon that's the best solution, but we can't do that in transfer deadline day. Yeah. Even Jim White can't sort that. I'll tell you that way, and he's a hero, it. But I've got to leave it.